if the elections do not push through, or if they push through with an incredible result, they will result in one thing, that is a setback once again for the country. Uh, there's going to be political squabbling, who knows what kind of problems will arise after that. I mean, even, uh, particularly now, when public's mind is being conditioned by some people to, to the effect that there will be a failure of elections, that if some people lose, it can be only, it can only be through cheating or being cheated. I mean, it's going to be, it, we're already in a very volatile situation. Uh, and uh, the failure of elections through uh, over ambition or lack of experience or knowledge with uh, the kind of technology going to be used or through a failure of equipment is going to be disastrous. That's why I urge the COMELEC. To me, I, you cannot convince me that the delivery of the equipment in the end of February and with all the problems that we have we're rumored to be hearing, whether rumored or true, I think the COMELEC should already be very realistic into, in, on what it can do with the kind of automation it uh, foresees. And delivery at the end of February, teachers training only in March because they may forget. That means to say they're only going to be trained once. <laughs> and uh, and uh, other circumstances would warrant some degree of extra prudence on the part of the COMELEC. We've seen even high-tech equipment or more sophisticated equipment we uh, come in two years, three years, there's still bugs in them. What more now? Manual. Manual, uh, manual uh, counting once again, which again puts us in a predicament where people say, we might say that, you know, we wanted manual from the start or whatnot. Uh -huh. I think the COMELEC owes it to all candidates owes it to all candidates and to judge their peculiar, peculiar circumstances to assure the people of a credible election. Burdens for a credible election cannot be put on candidates, parties, or whether administration or opposition that, should, that falls squarely on the shoulders of Comelec.